Okay. So the first step, you're going to go to investopedia.com. You might want to get to that link. And then over here in the upper right-hand corner, there's a little button there that says register. You're going to click that little register button. Some of you might already have an account. If you do, you can just sign in right there. Investopedia, I-N-V-E-S-T-O-P-E-D-I-A.com. Okay, you can log into your with your Facebook, and then it automatically populates all these fields. But if you don't want to have your Facebook linked into this, you can type in your your information separately. I'm going to register my Aloni ID and uh, my username is going to be B A one twenty five teach. Okay, uh, and. Uh, Set a password, right? So pretty simple, right? Username, password, email, for ship. So register, right? Oh, are you a financial advisor or registered investment advisor? No, I'm not, and you guys shouldn't be either. Okay. So first step, there's there's three there's four steps. You guys see them there in the up in the middle upper part. So step two is free newsletters. So like right here, it asks me, are you? No, I'm not. Select all free, no, I don't want to do that. So please do not include me in messages, right? Because we don't want to be bothered. If you guys want to sign up for some of these, go for it. But So I'm going to say please do not continue. Next one, exclusive offers. So do I want any of these? Free prof profit blueprint, Zacks. A lot of stuff. Good thing none of them are checked. Continue. If you want to sign up for those, you can. I don't recommend it. All right, free member registration. You can even get this on your phone if you want. You can download the app. So it says, uh, thank you for registering. Welcome to Investopedia. At this point, you should have registered a new user, and you should get an email like this confirming your uh, that you completed the, uh, the registration. And you can complete your profile. You don't have to. If you click that, it just takes you to a screen uh, where it goes to your account and you can actually type in all this information here but that's not necessary you can, you can upload your own avatar your own photo of yourself um, you can type in information here but that's not required for this class that's up to you whether you want to do that or not um, but once you um, finish the registration process you should go back to a screen like this back to the home page and you should now see your username in the upper right hand corner so I'm logged in right now as BA125 teach if you don't see this it should say sign in and you need to go ahead and sign in once you're signed in you should be seeing a screen like this where your username is there next step is to click stock simulator on the right hand corner and it should take you to a screen like this now follow close attention here you have to click view more games view more games at the bottom here click this because that will then allow you to um, search for a game and we could type it in now and the game we're all gonna join is BA 125 fall 15 start search you should just see one game it should have started on 9 1 2015 that's when I created the game it never ends so this game will go on for the rest of all of our lives and you can check in here even after this class and this this video is for all my BA 125 classes so you might be doing this on as an online class you might be doing this as in person and uh, I have this little feedback button here but you wanna find the game and then all the way on the right here if your screens not big enough it's gonna be all the way to the right you might even have to scroll over to the right and then click join now you have officially joined the game. If you go to um, rankings, you should see your name there. So here I am, BA125 Teach. So I know I'm in the game now. If you can't see your name, don't worry about it. Sometimes it takes a little bit of time to update the game. Like um, it updates at midnight or 1 a.m. in the morning, so you might not see your name till the following day. So don't worry if you don't see your name. But after a couple days, if you don't see your name, then uh, either email me or or um, try rejoining the game. All right, so now you're registered for Investopedia.com and you've joined the game. Uh, next thing to do would be to check out the simulator how-to guide. 
Um, you can go to the tutorial section on Investopedia and uh, you can search for you know simulator so there it is in S if you go down to S there's a simulator how-to guide and that's a great way to kind of understand how to trade how to work the whole simulator game and the different ways you can use it um, I think it also gives you a little bit of information on uh, what kind of stocks to buy or you can also find that in this area like you can find almost anything here it even tells you like how to buy a car it gives you you know how to a complete guide to your retirement planning a complete guide to buying a condo buying a car a new car a used car so this is great uh, not only for the stock game but for any kind of finance or business or budgeting or or anything or your credit um, anything that you're kind of interested in doing these are free resources for you so I definitely check those out um, <clears throat> and then the simulator how-to guide is a good way to learn the simulator and then lastly a lot of you might be wondering well what stock should I buy you know how do I buy them things like that I have made a video on how to do that um, so I'm just gonna link to that video what you do is you can go to youtube.com and then just search uh, Drew Patterson building a portfolio and uh, I made a video here it's by Drew Patterson Investopedia simulator building a portfolio and that's this video here all right congrats and uh, should say this Investopedia Simulator Building a Portfolio, Drew Patterson, published on January 26, 2015. Um, and then the description is um, how to use and build your portfolio Investopedia, walkthrough of the Investopedia Simulator, stock trading strategies, and other resources is what I talk about in this video. And I'll go ahead and give a shout out to all my BA 125 students. That should also be in the description as well so now it should say hi so go to this uh, video if you want to learn more about building your portfolio some of you might already know how to trade stocks and you don't need to watch this video others of you this video should be very helpful in uh, figuring out how to buy and sell uh, stocks best of luck to all you let the best trader win there is going to be prizes for who gets the most money who has the most money by the end of the class, and who loses the most money. All right, best of luck.